We are currently looking to improve mission duration of power systems for unmanned vehicles, including underwater and aerial. So that's UUV and UAVs. UAVs in particular, the market is growing vastly, and the small drones are widely used. There is a huge market in the commercial sector for inspection services, remote monitoring, I mean, even going as far as monitoring herds. The UAV program currently at h &E is actually headed by the Naval Research Lab in Washington, D.C., who is working towards developing their own line of ultra-lightweight fuel cells for unmanned vehicles in the one to seven kilowatt range. We provide the testing services, consulting, and component evaluation, along with some development work for the Naval Research Lab. If you want to fly longer, you need more batteries. If you need more batteries, your systems are going to weigh more, and those lightweight systems don't like a lot of the weight. So hydrogen fuel cells in particular offer an alternative for those power systems, and they can achieve almost five to 10 times longer flight durations. I am presently working on weight reduction of the the hydrogen delivery system, eliminating some of these larger metal components and replacing them with ultra lightweight valves typically used in cube satellites. I am developing a new control algorithm to use these ultra lightweight valves for pressure control and replace some of these larger bulky metal components that are now used. Here at High Surf, I have access to both battery experts and fuel cell experts that assist me on some of the processes that are going on inside the hydrogen fuel cells while I work on the larger scale systems and applications into those vehicles.